a very, very happy Friday to you. Hello, it's Mike Russell here from musicradiocreative.com. We are streaming live right now. Nine minutes to 2 p.m. in the UK on a lovely sunny Friday here on the Isle of Wight. If you are watching the replay, welcome along. Remember, you can always skip forward eight minutes and get straight to the content, okay? No need to hang around for this pre-show chat unless you want to, okay? Uh, we're getting into Adobe Audition and we're going to be making acapellas today. It's all very exciting. Very exciting indeed. How are you today? Let me know how you're doing in the chat. We've got Renato, who was in first today. Amazing stuff. Two hours before the live stream over at youtube.com slash musicradiocreative. Nice to see you there. David Silk as well. Nightbot's in. Pete, lovely to see you. Welcome along. Great to have you watching today. to Michael. Joe as well is in. Nice to see you, Joe. David Lewis is here. Frank Woes as well. Inspired by yesterday's show, I extended the home studio with the Euphoria external sound card just arrived online it is so fast. I know, isn't it just? David Hunter's in. Nice to see you again, David. Welcome back to you. We've got Kelvin Guy Reviews as well. Dr. Fahad. Mr. Mega Radio UK. William Harper. Great to see you in. Pedro is here. Hello, Pedro. So we're just in the pre-show warm-up. Five minutes and 44 seconds to go. Afternoon, Benny boy. Good to see you. Do tell your friends about this today. And uh, I've got a little something special for you. Uh, I may as well tell you before we go live. I'm going to use Nightbot for another feature today. I'm going to have a giveaway during the show. There will be a prize up, to gra up for grabs uh, for... For anyone who's active in the chat today, so if you post something in the chat today, you go into a draw that I'll make just before the end of the show to win something. I'll tell you what you can win uh, when we're live on the air, as it were. Just in the pre-show bit right now. Five minutes to go. So yes, if you're just kind of watching and lurking and you've never posted before, uh, do post in the YouTube live comments at youtube.com slash musicradiocreative and we'll have a giveaway for anyone who posts in the YouTube live chat. It's not just Pedro, it's Pedro from Brazil. Wow. Pedro from Brazil. 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 The winning is just beginning. The winning is just beginning. That used to be a tagline on a radio station I worked at. And here's another one. It's Feel Good Friday. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, careful now. Careful, David. <laughs> Nightbot's a little picky. Thanks, Kelvin Guy Reviews. Really appreciate that. Matthew Volkman as well. Watch the studio behind the scenes. Curious to know which mic you use for recording audio. It is the 
Audio Technica AT4033. Williams from Guyana, South America, close to Brazil. Do be careful about posting all caps. Nightbot is not a fan of that. <laughs> and will time you out from posting if you do that. Abby Joe, how do you do the timer countdown and what software do you use for live streaming? Abby, I use OBS Studio and I'm going to be doing a live show on that in the future. Um, I do this live show every weekday, Monday to Friday, 2 p.m. UK time, whatever time that is for you. And for the countdown, best place to go is to community.musicradiocreative.com uh, where I've posted a little post in there uh, linking to the exact thing I used to generate uh, that rather smooth countdown. David is very excited. You're allowed to be excited. It's good to be excited. You can only post three comments within 10 seconds. Is that true? The Crazy Gamer, Meep, love you, man. You're awesome. Thank you. To answer your question, Toka, um, each live show lasts exactly one hour. We go from 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. UK time, okay? 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. UK time. Which is the morning for you over in the Americas. It's late night down under. It's evening in places like the Philippines, Bangladesh, India. It's uh, middle of the day, mid-afternoon here in Europe. You're welcome, Abby. Can I explain how I can set up parallel compression for vocals? Does it fit the show today? Um, what exactly do you mean by parallel compression to vocals? You can go into a bit more detail on that. I can do my best to help. I'm so excited for another live stream, says Music Man. My second one, and you're doing a great job. You're really helping and motivating me to get at my dreams. That is what it's all about, Music Man. So thank you. Thank you for that encouragement. Thanks, Joe, for posting the number. Yep, it is 415-800-1055. The line's open in one minute from now. Testing the left speaker. Left. left. Testing the right speaker. Right. right. Testing phaser. 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 Stand by. Stand by. Stand by for music radio creative live with Mike Russell. MRC Live. Music radio creative live with Mike Russell. Starting in 30 seconds. We are live. It is Music Radio Creative Live, and I'm so excited to be here. I am Mike Russell, uh, the creative director here at Music Radio Creative, where we make all kinds of creative audio. That could be a, a jingle, an a cappella, a voiceover, some imaging, music, anything you want to use on your podcast, your radio show, if you're a DJ, if you're a business looking to get creative audio, an advert cut up, then uh, that's what we do here at Music Radio Creative. Great to see so many of you uh, here in the chat already, right over there. You can see the chat uh, just flying by, and uh, we'll be answering some of your questions also, I'm really excited to tell you, we have a giveaway. And in the spirit of acapellas, uh, if you are uh, posting nicely into the um, the YouTube live chat today, I know we're in other places like Facebook and, and Twitch and such like, um, but if you post into the YouTube chat today, you will be in the draw uh, automatically uh, to be a winner by the end of this stream. And I'll be giving away... Uh, one decade from our Sung Years package at Music Radio Creative. So what is the Sung Years package? You can buy it from our website at musicradiocreative.com and uh, when you buy all the decades, it costs $99, US dollars that is, and you get the 70s, 80s, 90s, uh, the noughties, and even the 10s right the way up, I think, until 2020. Is that right? Do we have 2020? Let's check. 2020. 2020. 
Yeah. All right, 2020 then. Uh, here's an alternative take, 2020. 2020. Yeah. yeah. Just uh, preparing you for the future, of course. Or if you want to go back to the 80s, you can pick one decade, by the way, if you're a winner out of these uh, five decades we've got. They uh, retail individually at 25 US dollars each. Uh, if you want to go back to the 80s, I mean, feel free to do that. You can go back here. Living in 1985. Living in 1985. So as you can see, they're not, they're not just sung years. These are really creative sung years. 1984, how about that? Do, 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 1984. I really like the 80s, maybe because I'm a bit of an 80s fan. Let's try this. Do, 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 1983. And all of the uh, the sung years we have in this sung uh, jingles package uh, are themed to the decade. So if we uh, fast forward to the 90s. Yeah, 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 yeah. 1994 Which is cool And then of course right up to uh, the late 90s Ooh, 1999. So you can really jazz up your show If you maybe you do uh, a, a podcast uh, related to certain years Or maybe you have a radio show Where you go back in time to a certain decade uh, Then one of these years uh, are going to be really good for you. So, yeah, if you're the winner by the end of the show and the way you enter, you get entered automatically. Nightbot will automatically see you if you post at the live chat between 2 p.m. and 3 p.m., like now while we're live, not after the show. Uh, so don't post like when the show is restreaming because you won't get entered. But <laughs> if you're watching live now, do post inside the chat at youtube.com slash music radio creative and uh, you can then pick one decade uh, from our sung years package. You could even pick the 70s if you like. Ooh, 1975. Okay, so that's the giveaway on the show today. Uh, the way to get in there is just posting in the chat. It really is as simple and as easy as that. Every 15 minutes, I will be mentioning and answering anything that you have to say or ask inside the live chat, so uh, make sure you do that. But otherwise, we'll just hop over and take a look at uh, Adobe Audition and start working uh, with some acapellas and uh, making some really cool acapellas. Uh, got some other stuff to look at a little bit later. Uh, like the Music Radio Creative Community and I might have a play in Logic Pro to make some uh, some drum tracks but let's get started now and uh, and have a look at what we've got I've got some uh, some files here to play with um, I've got quite a lot at different BPMs as well let's just sort that differently uh, so what do we got here we got some stuff here uh, uh, that actually we're producing for Liam I know he's a regular viewer of the stream Mega Radio UK uh, we've also got this one here and which one am I going to start with how am I feeling I'm feeling very happy it is a feel good Friday the weather's good here on the Isle of Wight today so why not work uh, with this one it's a uh, Helium Karaoke, uh, yes, an order that we created for a, a company called Helium Karaoke, and I thought this was really uh, rather a fun jingle. So I'm going to have a play with acapellaing this a little bit. Uh, so first of all, let me just uh, move this files menu so I can see the files a bit clearer and uh, start a new multi-track session. I'm going to call it Helium Karaoke, and it's going to be not my MRC template. I'm just going to go for none uh, so I can have like a fresh, clean slate to work from. Uh, so let's drop in all of these uh, voices here. There they go. So there's the uh, there are the acapellas. Doesn't that look pretty? Like a, like a nice little Adobe Audition rainbow. And um, then we'll whack in the bed down there. It creates a new track. The original Adobe Audition green there for that track. And um, let's just move this acapella well, first of all, actually, I'm going to zoom out uh, like that and move the acapella out of the way so you can get a feel for the music that we've been working to for this particular order. It sounds like this. Oh, it's very twee, isn't it? <laughs> yes, I love it. This is like uh, the music you get on explainer videos on YouTube, isn't it? All you have to do is drag and drop. Download our app now from the App Store. <laughs> and it ends like this. It's pretty much a, a similar bed all the way through. 
perfect. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I have not processed any of these uh, a cappella vocals yet. I'm just going to line it up with the music, make sure it fits, uh, and then we'll see what else we can do with it. Now, this is running at around 128 yes! BPM. Oh, very nice of you, Hadel, to subscribe to the channel. Really, really do appreciate that. Uh, right, let's just see. Where are we? Probably around there. Let me just check. It's time no, that's not right, is it? Let's move it along. It's time for there, maybe around there. Ha, huh, I think we've got it now. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, by the way, I didn't open my telephone app, and I've got a feeling uh, somebody is trying to call. So let me try and uh, open the telephone app and see if indeed that is. Because for some reason it routes through to my mobile phone as well, which is quite fun. Yes. If um, whoever was calling there, if you could call back... I've just fired up the telephone app. I forgot to open it. Sorry. Yes, if you want to call the show, the live stream at any time, the number is... Yes! This number. 415-800-1055. So all you have to do is call that number if you want to get through and, uh, and chat to me uh, right now. So uh, I'm just going to move this in here and turn the music bed down a little bit. In fact, I'll mute it out. Just play along. And it's a little bit loud at the moment, all of that. So I'm just going to uh, take the levels down a little bit. Minus six, minus six, minus six, minus six on all of these. So we've got some headroom to play with as we work with this acapella and add some funky effects. Getting there, nearly there. There we go. Right, let's check that again. Check the levels. Just play along. That's much better, isn't it? Uh, so, uh, what does this sound like when we actually listen to it in context? Might need to turn that down too. It's time for helium. Not quite there on the beat, is it yet? So, let's just move this in. I think we need to go about that. Let's try that. Just play along. Okay, so you can hear a rough mix of this. This is by no means produced yet, but this is a rough mix of how the jingle sounds. It's time for helium karaoke on the McCrazy Experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along, play along. So that's how it all kind of fits together. But now, as you can hear, there's no real processing on that sung voice. There's no panning. Uh, there's no EQ. There's nothing going on there. So um, that's where now I've got this nicely lined up with the bed. I'll mute out the bed, and we're going to focus just solely on this a cappella here. And there are so many little things we can do uh, to really make these vocals all pop out. Uh, mastering will be a final step on here, but first of all, we are going to get into uh, this. Um, one minute and 14 seconds. Um, what does that mean? I've just had one minute and 14 seconds. I'm completely confused about that. Someone has just thrown one minute and 14 seconds in my face. Um, oh, okay, that's when the vocals match. Well, I think I just matched them anyway. There, Isabella's telling me where to place the vocals in this track. One minute and 14 seconds. Oh, that's a good good time to get a phone call. Let's, uh, let's take the phone call. <laughs> Hello, uh, who's this? Hey, Mike. Hey. Uh, this, this, is the, this is the crazy gamer. And, uh, hey. I, oh, man, it's just... Uh, <laughs> It's just so cool being on the actual show, <laughs> if you know what I mean. It's awesome. Uh, <laughs> How are you? What are you up yeah, to today? Uh, yeah, I'm actually going to school right now. Oh, I you? guess you're the only person I actually watch to like Thank you. like tutorials for like Adobe Audition, Audacity, awesome. some of those good programs. And uh, man, I just my mouth is like ah. Amazing! This is so cool. The Crazy Gamer, where are you located? Where are you calling from? 
Um, Los Angeles, actually. Los Angeles, California. I am just, uh, uh, yeah, I'm a little bit jealous right now because that's a cool city. I really like LA. So what are you learning at school? Uh, mostly about film, but there's really nothing they could teach me there because I'm self-taught on everything. So You're really up with everything, are you? Yeah. Awesome, awesome. So you're learning film and you're doing audio with that. That's that's amazing. What project have you worked on recently? Anything interesting you can share with us? Um, there's a there's a video I'm I'm gonna post later on. It's for um it's for my aunt's birthday, and I did her a video of one of her favorite movies and her favorite um genre of song. Wow, that sounds really good. You know what? You should share that uh, with us, uh, maybe in the Music Radio Creative Community. All right. Uh, and just finally, oh, yeah. <laughs> Before you go, what's your favorite game? You're a crazy gamer, so what's your favorite game? Uh, I gotta say Halo, because because I, I grew oh. up with that series. Awesome, nice. Well, crazy gamer, I appreciate you very much. Amazing of you to call in. All right, all the best. All right, I'm love you, man. You got you're like the best. <laughs> I love you too, man. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye. All right. <laughs> that's, that's the crazy gamer calling in from Los Angeles, California. How awesome is that? Um, if you want to call the show, you can do on this number. 415-800-1055. A crazy gamer is a, a huge Halo fan. And, uh, yeah, just calling in and say, hey, uh, he's watching the live stream and on the way in to learn about film production, which is awesome. So uh, thank you for calling. You can call for any reason. You can call to ask me a question or just call to... Um, to call in and be on i'm quite happy with that 415-800-1055 if you're outside the united states it's plus one and uh for those of you who are new to the show saying why is uh why is this british guy on the isle of Wight using a u.s number uh well the reason is i um look at my audience analytics and the biggest chunk of viewers i have are in the united states so i thought well we'll start with a us number and uh, and that should be pretty sweet so 4158101055 is the number for you to uh, call in if you'd like to get on the air just like the crazy gamer did uh, now yeah isabella was just uh, shouting in my ear that i should move the acapella to 1 minute and 14 seconds i thought it worked quite well at the end not that it really matters, because uh, we're working on the acapella now, but let's just try this and see if it's a match. It's time. Oh, I see, yeah, because it's got a little drum lift, hasn't it? It's time. Let's get that uh, in the right place. It's time. Just got to get this all matched up nice. It's time. Maybe there. It's time for helium karaoke. Yeah, that's it. On the McCrazy Experience. That works. Oh, awesome. Yeah, so I, I see what Isabella was saying now. Yeah, she. <laughs> I'm glad the crazy gamer called in to break up that little interlude because <laughs> she was holding a sign up just outside the studio saying one minute, 14 seconds in big letters. <laughs> and there I was trying to place the acapella at the end of, of the music. But it actually works really well there, doesn't it, with the um, the drum beat and the, the, the uh, piano coming in at the end. Uh, so let's mute this off then. Anyway, now we've got it in the right place. Um, and we're going to play with each individual uh, stem now. So just to show you what we got when we have an acapella, we got. It's time for helium. We've got that, and then we've got this. It's time for helium. And we've got this. It's time for helium. So what we do first and foremost is we triple. Oh, wow! Another phone call. We triple up uh, acapellas. But let's go here. Hello, MRC Live. You're on the air. Who's this? Hello. Speak. I can see you there. I can see your lines active, but maybe something's not working. Faders open. Hello. You, you're on. Yep. Yeah. Hello. Who's that? Hello. I'm Sam. Sam. Where are you calling from, Sam? Um, New Zealand. From where? New Zealand. New Zealand. Wow. And what prompted you to call in, Sam? I think we've got quite a delay on the line, unfortunately. Nope. Gone. Hung up. <laughs> oh, well. 415-800-1055. Uh, 
That's cool. Maybe Friday is the day where uh, the, the the phone calls come in. It's very very exciting. Now remember, we're we're sixteen minutes into the show. There is a giveaway today. Uh, so just before I get back to it, uh, I'm going to give away one decade, and it can be the decade of the winner's choosing uh, from our Sung Years Jingle Package. Um, this basically, if you want to get all five decades, you can buy them from MusicRadioCreative.com uh, for uh, ninety nine US dollars. Each individual decade is available for twenty five US dollars each. So the prize I'm giving away is worth 25 US dollars. Um, and let's just listen to some of the uh, acapellas from 2004. Ah, ah, 2004. Nice, 2006. Let's... Yeah, 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 yeah. 2006. So you can pick your, your decade and you get like uh, one or two uh, produced cuts. You get a dry cut as well. Really, really cool. Uh, great prize to get. And you just uh, you get entered into the draw by being active in the chat on YouTube live at youtube.com slash music radio creative because I'm going to use Nightbot at the end uh, to pick out a winner. Uh, but now let's go and uh, take a look at uh, some of the stuff we have got going on in the live chat um, because I always love to... Uh, kind of feature you at, uh, well, 15-minute interludes usually during the show. And I'm really pleased to say uh, that we have uh, a great question and answers app that we use to get these uh, lower thirds up, uh, the wonderful lower thirds that appear on your screen uh, when when I'm answering a question. Uh, for instance, if I was to say... Um, Something like, uh, Joe is wondering if there's any sound. I, I sure do hope so. Uh, this, this, by the way, this piece of code that generates this, you can get it yourself. It's open source at mrc.fm slash YouTube questions, uh, created by a wonderful member of the MRC community, uh, Ule from Norway. Uh, so, yeah, just going to have a look around. Uh, lovely to see you, uh, Kelvin, by the way. Kelvin Guy Review says, new here and just subscribe to the channel. So it's great to have you here. We do a daily live stream here, which is absolutely fantastic. Uh, what else have we got? Let's have a look at some of the other uh, questions that have come in. Uh, oh, yes, this is an interesting one. Abby Joe, how do you do the timer countdown and what software do you use for the live stream? Answer this one actually earlier in the pre-show chat, but it might ha be handy to someone who's just tuned in. I use OBS Studio and uh, the uh, the template and the way I created the, uh, the morphing countdown to my show uh, is available uh, for you to look up at community.musicradiocreative.com. Uh, that is our wonderful uh, and very exciting community. So hop in there, community.musicradiocreative.com. Uh, also, this is really cool. Joe, one of our moderators, says if you're new to the show, just type NEW, all in caps, into the uh, live chat and let us know. And also subscribe, hit the bell, and you'll never miss another live stream, which is fantastic. Uh, who else can we shout out at this section? We've got Eve Marks, uh, who's saying, uh, I'm finally in early. Uh what have we got? Oh, this is uh, an interesting question uh, that has come in from uh, Pete. Uh, setting up parallel compression on vocals. Uh, that may be an interesting thing to dive into at some, at some point during the show. Uh, what else have we got in here? Uh, oh, let's see whether we can uh, pop this one on. Um, We've got Godemma Records. Hi, can you assist me in Adobe Audition 3.0? I wish to know how to put on the grids so that I can better put songs on tempo. Um, well, actually, this is a good point to show you this now because I'll work to the BPM of the acapella I'm on. So uh, here we are in Adobe Audition. I guess it might work the same way in 3.0. I'm not sure. I know 3.0 was a bit more musical. It, it allowed VSTIs and MIDI to... Uh, Adobe Audition CC does not work with uh, VSTIs or MIDI. Um, but here, I can change the time display to be bars and beats here. Uh, and then we can set a certain BPM. So I know that this track is 128 BPM. So edit the tempo here. 128 needs to be the figure here. 128. There we go. And you will see now uh, that this should be if we've got everything lined up perfectly. Let me just check. This starts at the beginning here. Oh, yeah, so maybe uh, just trim that up so it starts bang on beat one. There we go. And select all, move it in a little bit. And let's have a look at that now. Right, so, 
Yeah. And you can see, yes, everything is there. Now, there's no grid as such to work with in Audition. Um, but what you can do is you can turn on this magnet here, toggle snapping, or hit the S hotkey to switch it on. And you'll find then that you will be able to snap to the, uh, the beats of a track. And you see here, this is actually now snapping for me. You see that snap there? That is snapping to the... Uh, the uh, each each individual beat of the track, which is quite handy if I need to place things like like you mentioned onto uh, a grid in Adobe Audition's multi-track. So that's how you could do it. Uh, S to toggle that off because I don't really want to be doing that. And back into this acapella, which I'm going to tidy up first. Uh, so the first thing, and this is the really coolest thing, if you're starting every single track of the acapella at the same point, you can then do a fade in like this, see, look, and you can do it as long as you've got them all selected, you can make that fade on all your tracks, which is a nice time-saving shortcut. So let's just maybe move that over like that and have a listen. It's time for Helium Karaoke. Right, the first thing I'm going to do to separate out these acapellas is I'm going to move this over to the left and this over to the right. Uh, and I was explaining to you earlier that um, we triple up our voices. So we got essentially three different cuts sung. It's time for helium. And then we've got this. It's time for helium. And then we've got this. It's time for helium. And obviously if I take them off, you can hear them individually. We've got this one. It's time for helium. So obviously. It's time for helium. When we mix those all together. It's time for helium. And then we bring in the stereo double and triple tracks like this. It's time for helium. You start to get that really wide sound. Again, over here, I'm going to pan left and right on here. It's time for helium karaoke. And that should already start to sound beautiful in your ears if you're uh, listening to the stream in stereo right now. Uh, next thing I will do is I will go through and just cut this up a little bit more. I want to kind of cut out all the breaths and all of that. So that's that's an important part of the process to me. And again, I can do the, uh, the fade envelope out and the fade envelope in here, making sure not to cut off any of the uh, audio. Jordan2516, thank you so much for following on Twitch. And I'm so excited to see uh, that the viewers to this show on Twitch are increasing uh, over time. So really, really appreciate you if you're watching live on Twitch right now. And I give you a shout out. I can see uh, Casino Duckling uh, is saying nay for Twitch chat. Uh, and then has posted a, uh, a poot <laughs> emoticon. Um, yeah, Casino Duckling, uh, I really appreciate you watching on Twitch. And at some point, I'm going to set up Nightbot and get stuff going on in the Twitch chat room. But just at the moment, most of the audience are over on YouTube and Facebook. Uh, so kind of focusing over there at the moment. Um, but yeah, I do understand the need to pay attention to Twitch. Uh, and uh, Jordan2516 said, I got a Twitch ad. I feel very sorry for you. <laughs> Sometimes you do. Yeah, I mean, they're a great platform. That's why I stream on them, uh, because they're owned by Amazon now. They used to be just in TV. Um, and yeah, I appreciate you, uh, you tuning in via Twitch. That's just awesome. I think it's a great platform. Um, yeah, especially if you like watching games as well in action. Uh, right, what have we got here? Yeah, so I'm just tidying up this a cappella right now, which is uh, fantastic. So we'll get all these nice crossfades in. This is a real smooth and easy way to do it. And then when I play the a cappella back the next time, you should notice uh, that there are no breaths or anything like that. So just again, chopping down here, doing that. I can actually completely chop these bits out because they're silent. Let's listen to what we got now. It's time for Helium Karaoke. On the McCrazy Experience We know it's stupid Just play along Play along And now if I want to be really accurate with this and I'm going to work on this acapella for another five minutes then I'll take some more of your comments and questions and then I'm going to move on to another acapella to kind of mix it up and uh, keep the variety going on this here live stream. It's time for helium. So let's go into effects rack right now and add on some of the MRC magic. It's time for helium. So we've got quite a bit going on there. And I'm also going to add in a stereo bus. Thank you, David Silk, for the Alt B stereo bus creation hotkey there. And um, we'll call this sung vocals. 
and then we'll just uh, make sure that we zoom in and send all of the sung vocals to a sung vocal bus uh, where we can do other stuff to it later on. Uh, so let's go bus, sung vocals, bus, sung vocals, uh, bus, sung vocals, bus, sung vocals, and bus sung vocals. Okay, so everything's now going to into that individual bus. And to show you how a bus works, if I am playing this track here, this individual track, it's time for helium karaoke. you should notice if I take it off solo and we have all the tracks together, it's time for helium. they all come out on that bus there. It's time for helium. Which is really, really cool. Uh, so first and foremost, uh, now I'm going to go over here. So we've got the MRC magic going on. And it's time for helium karaoke. So as you can hear, adding that preset in, if I take it back to default, it's time for helium karaoke. My Adobe Audition preset there makes a real difference to the voice. It's time for helium karaoke. Which is exactly what we we'll want. Lifting things up, uh, adding on a bit of dynamics processing, a bit of magic there uh, to make the voice sound really good. Parametric EQ, I might just uh, flatten this and work from scratch uh, and see how it sounds. So it's, let's find a sound I like. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along, play along. Let's just uh play It's with time it. for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along, play along. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along, play along. Let's roll off some bass here as well. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. That's sounding okay, um, but another plugin I like to use quite a lot, particularly on a cappellas, is uh, something from Isotope called Isotope uh, Neutron. Uh, let's find it. There it is, Neutron. Uh, and you can really do some really cool shaping here. Uh, so let's get into this. And uh, first of all, we've got an equalizer here, which looks really sweet. It's really time nice. for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along, play along. So that's doing really nice things. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We've got a bit of compression going on as well through Neutron. Uh, Exciter. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. And we've got some transient shaper on as well, which is adding a nice flavor to it all. I'm actually going to save that now as a preset, which we'll just call it MRC Acapella, like that. And then what I can do is I can go through and add on that MRC Acapella to each other track. And then I'll bring them all together and see how it sounds and see if I need to put any effects on the bus as well. Uh, like, for instance, reverb uh, and bits like that. So just the final part in the process now. Uh, MRC Acapella, again over here, sort of copying and pasting effects rack from one track to the next. MRC Acapella there, and MRC Acapella there. Then we'll take this off solo and we'll bring everything in. It's time for Helium Karaoke on the McCrazy. A bit of jitter there, I think that's my CPU. Let's try again. It's time for Helium Karaoke on the McCrazy Experience. For some reason that's really jittering, so what I'm going to do is uh, select everything. Actually, let's zoom out like that. Select all of that a cappella like that, and I'm just going to bounce it down to a new track. Uh, what should we do here? Select Eclipse in Time Selection. Bouncing, 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 taking a little bit of time and uh, we will get there eventually. 
Yes, CPU is struggling. Got something? There we go. Okay, cool. I'm just going to normalize that to prevent it from overclipping there. And then we'll go back here, solo that, send it out to the Sung Vocals bus. Let's have a listen. It's time for Helium Karaoke on the McCrazy Experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along. Play along. Yeah, I think my... Uh my CPU is really struggling to keep up with things. Maybe now, if I go ahead and delete everything that I've done there, just get that bounce down uh, a cappella. It's time for helium karaoke on the crazy experience. We know it's stupid. Just play along. And again with a bit of reverb. Play along. And then on solo. Play along. It's time for helium karaoke. Quite a lot of reverb. I might take that down a bit. But there you go. You get the general idea of uh, mixing together one individual a cappella there. Uh, I'm going to get on to something else in just a moment. But first of all, I would like to hop back over to the Q&A. And obviously we... Uh, answered that one earlier uh, for God Emma Records uh, using a grid there uh, to make everything match nicely. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, Bojang, can you have more than one sidechain on a channel? As far as I know, I don't think you can in Adobe Audition. I have tried to do this before uh, myself. Sidechaining um, is usually where you have a, a compressor sidechaining to uh, auto duck music and bits like that. Um, and I haven't seen the opportunity to do that um, because there's only one, there only appears to be one route out for a sidechain, uh, whereas I know somewhere like Logic Pro, you can do more than one sidechain from what I understand. Um, so yeah, very good question there, Bojan, for you to ask. Um, what else have we got here uh, that's been coming in right now? We've got Isabella in the chat as well. GK's in there as well. Uh, Music Man, big shout out to David Hunter. Uh, Eve Marks, uh, who says, ha, 1994 is my year, uh, referring to the uh, the giveaway we've got going on during this session. If you post in the YouTube live chat at youtube.com uh, slash music radio creative, uh, you get to pick one decade out of our five decades available in our site jingle package for the years like this one yeah 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 1994 there you go kim c says awesome uh so yeah we'll we'll run that giveaway throughout this show this live stream and then somebody is going to win just before the end uh we got this question in from uh Toka, Toka, thank you so much for asking. Uh, he says that I do uh, parodies on my YouTube channel. Do you think Audition is good software to edit these kind of projects? Um, parodies, yeah, if you're editing the audio. If you're auto-tuning, there is a native uh, kind of auto-tuner you can use inside Adobe Audition. So definitely uh, go for it and give it a go. And, uh, and see how you get on with it. I, I highly recommend Adobe Audition for that kind of stuff. Music Man, have you done a video on how to do the EFX on multiple tracks for radio vocal effects? Um, I'm sure I have covered that at some point during my live stream. Um, but yeah, I could definitely get into that a little bit more. If you want to call the show, by the way, you can do that on this number. 415-800-1055 so uh, that is the number. Just add plus one if you're outside the US and uh, you can get in on that as well. Um, oh, this is interesting. Uh, David has said, I know how you can get a UK number with voicemail to go to your tablet on iOS and Android if you're interested. Uh, I'm using uh, Twilio uh, to, to have that US number working and that seems like a, a pretty good setup. We also have... Um, our Isle of Wight number, 01983 That's our um, customer service phone number for MRC. That also runs through Twilio, and it, it costs us a dollar a month to uh, to rent that, that telephone number. So really, really good service that they have at Twilio, I think. 
Um, let's see, what have we got here? Uh, we've got another one here from Eve. How do you usually receive acapellas from the voice artists? So they are usually broken down into individual stems uh, ready for us to, to mix together, uh, add panning to, add vocal effects, uh, reverb and stuff like that. Um, but generally, yes, there'll be uh, sort of layered stems of, um, of voices all individually uh, put together for you there. Uh, I do apologize, by the way, if I'm not getting to all of your... Uh <laughs> all of your comments it's uh it is quite tough to get through uh the comments but i do my best uh we've got xlx on facebook live watching anthony morris uh quality feeds learned a lot through facebook and your youtube uh, declan says sounds incredible you're awesome i have been watching a lot i wish to contact you directly is that possible uh yeah drop me a line uh, via community.musicradiocreative.com declan uh, that is the best place to get in touch uh thank you Joe for moderating in there as well. Uh, what else have we got here in the chat? Let's have a look. We've got uh, something here uh, from Christopher. Just had to let you know, once again, thanks to you, saved a bite for a piece in Nightly last night with a heel brush in Spectrum View. Or oh, referring back to uh, my uh, noise reduction tutorial on Adobe Audition. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, let's see if there's anything else uh, worth shouting out there is a particularly high volume of comments obviously because I'm running a giveaway today <laughs> kind of uh, looking through and seeing what we've got uh, oh we got this one from uh, Dan uh, Dan says how are you today hope you're good I'm Dan Aka Zentec DJ nice to see you in the chat Dan uh, we've got uh, <laughs> Jeff. Uh, that's actually very funny from Jeff uh, over there. <laughs> there. I think you need a call screener, if only. I don't have that privilege. If you call me on 415-800-1055, uh, then you get straight through uh, to the live show uh, with me on the air. Um, what else have we got here? Anything else? Uh, David, can I check when carrying out ENCN, that's equalize, normalize, compress, normalize on a wave file, would I be correct in thinking matching volume would be a form of normalizing? Yes, uh, well, matching loudness, if you do match loudness, which is what I assume the the feature that you'll be using. Match loudness is just like normalizing. It does not affect anything to do with the waveform. It won't change it, it won't compress it, it won't hard limit it, unless you tell it to. There is a feature in Audition where you can match loudness and hard limit at the same time. So you need to be careful about that. Um, but yeah, generally it's just trying to get the level of the audio uh, to the same level as everything else. So you you pick, pick, a, pick a setting, minus 16 luffs, and stick to it, and then away you go from there. Uh, anything else? Uh, we've got uh, David C, uh, voiceover actor. Wow, Easy Media donation to the show of two New Zealand dollars. That's awesome. Uh, Easy Media, really appreciate you there for uh, uh, popping that donation in. <laughs> I'm finding it particularly hard to keep up with the comments today uh, because of the, uh, the the giveaway going on. Yes, if you place a comment at youtube.com slash musicradiocreative, Nightbot may well pick you as a winner by the end of the show. So uh, do stick around for that uh, right to the end of this. This video which will be in about 20 minutes from now and uh we'll we'll get to that very soon um yeah i think that's it for now oh uh interesting one from david uh he says you can have uh, fine and coarse snapping fine will get you every little mark and coarse will miss the smaller points uh david there resident expert on adobe audition uh, shortcuts and productivity hacks uh so fine and coarse that's good to know that you can sort of fine grain uh, the snapping inside adobe audition and actually i would say that is extremely handy as well uh, so I think that is going to be it for now. By the way, yeah, uh, Liam has mentioned in the chat that is Kim singing on the vocals there. Um, so um, there we go. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, Kelvin is in and he says, uh, bloody phone, where do you get your plugins and add-ons? Um, well, uh, I have quite a few, as you'll see, if I go back to my screen share and show you. Uh, over here, if I go into the effects menu 
and go to audio units. Uh, got some stuff from Antares. Uh, obviously, the native Apple stuff. Uh, I've used Celemony's Melodyne before for auto tuning. Isotope. Uh, this is something I just downloaded um, because it was free, um, but I haven't really used it much. Melda Production, really good. They have their M Free Effects bundle, which is just amazing. You get so many cool things for free there. Uh, Plugin Alliance, uh, Synaptics Unveil for reducing echo and reverb on tracks. Isotope, really, for me, uh, I use, I currently use Isotope plugins the most in my chain. That's just simply how it works. Um, Waves Audio, really good. Shout out to Waves Audio as well. Uh, although I don't currently use their plugins, I used to use them all the time when I worked in radio. And I do miss them, actually. Uh, so maybe, yeah, maybe we'll include some Waves plugins on the show as well in the future. Um, right, let's uh, switch over and do a brand new acapella here. So we'll call this acapella two over here. And I'm going to have a look and see what we've got here. Uh, let's drag this in at uh, 126 BPM. So we'll need to change the BPMs here. Yep, BPM up there. So let's just click in. Edit tempo, 126 right now. And have a look at what we've got here. Well so I just need to make sure this uh, all matches up nicely. Well. And if we take the music bed out from there, we've got something that sounds like this. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. And we can do some uh, some funky effects with this. So as we know, it's 126 BPM. Uh, if I go over, let's actually put on some, uh, let's try the MRC acapella preset on this. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. And I think there might be a slight bit of auto-tune on those stems as well. Uh, so let's just uh, pop in the, uh, the settings here just to beef up this a cappella now a little bit. And then I'm going to have a play uh, with adding some nice vocal effects to this a cappella to make it really stand out. Uh, MRC a cappella and MRC a cappella here. And we're probably going to need to reduce the, uh, the volumes on this as well to make it sound good. Here we go. Uh, so we'll do that as well. I uh, can do this either over here or in the mix of you. It's uh, quite easy to just go along each track at the bottom here and go minus six, minus six, minus six over there. Turn these all down a little bit so that we've got some nice headroom to play with. There we go. And there, and finally there. So again, uh, three sung tracks and they're tripled up. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. Making it nice and stereo as well for you, for your ears. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. I can hear Adobe Audition is struggling to keep up with me today. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm not doing anything too intensive, but uh, yeah, it's definitely having an issue uh, keeping up with the yes! uh, the uh, <laughs> all the effects I want to do. So I, Welcome to do you know what I might do in that case? Uh, Lightning Bolts over here pre-render your tracks for you so they freeze all of these effects. I've got a feeling all the effects that I'm placing onto the acapella is just throwing my CPU into a state of fit. Uh, so hitting the Lightning Bolt in the mixing desk on all your tracks will pre-render uh, anything you've got going on. Uh, that's good. I noticed I didn't put the uh, MRC acapella preset. Let's try this now. It should work okay now. Welcome to the po oh. Positive Change Guru Podcast. And Liam's absolutely right. That is uh, Gavin there on the uh, sung vocals. So now what I'm going to do is uh, take 126 BPM and uh, calculate the uh, the different milliseconds on that, so I can do some echo. Let's have a look. There is actually a really good website for calculating BPM, if you like. Um, 
here you go, let me show it to you over here. Uh, if you go here, it's quite a long URL, but if you type BPM calculator, uh, it's uh, sengpilaudio.com slash calculator dash BPM tempo time dot htm. Uh, but it's really good because it'll give you your millisecond calculations for that BPM. Uh, so 476-238-159-119. Uh, so we could do something with that. Let's bring that out of view for a second, and I'm going to add an echo to a couple of these tracks. Let's try this. Uh, delay and echo, echo, and we're gonna go for 476, no, not seven, 476, and we'll go for 238 as well, on one side, like that. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. And then what I'm gonna do is save this as a cappella echo and we'll place this onto just a few of the doubled up tracks here. So uh, down here, I'm going to do it again, MRC Acapella Echo, and again down here, MRC Acapella Echo. Let's listen to this. Rendering and play. Welcome to the positive CPU is going up. Guru So that's quite nice, and the uh, the echo is ending, uh, preserving all the highs and uh, rolling off the lows. Could do it the other way around on one of them, so we keep some lows in there. Let's see how this would sound with the mix. Welcome to the positive change, Guru Podcast. That's nice. I apologise for the uh, the stutters as I'm playing back. Yeah, um, let's see what my CPU usage is. 10%. Hmm. <laughs> so why why is there a problem with audition today? I, I just do not know. doesn't usually do this to me. It's the first time in a while it's done it. Uh, I'm going to throw something else in to see how it would affect things. Uh, let's do it on one of these stems. Let's do it on a stem here. Welcome to the Positive Change Guru Podcast. And I'm going to bring in... Uh, isotope vocal synth and see if we can uh, mangle the voice a little bit. Let's try. That's really weird, isn't it? That's really weird. Uh, now what we can do, let's actually switch off pitch correction. I'm not sure I want to do pitch correcting today, uh, but we can do a vocoder. Or uh, I really like the uh, CompuVox that's available to you uh, again inside here. Um, so let's try and enable that. Gosh, yeah, everything is slowing right down to a lag on my computer at the moment. To the change, the and that's very low in the mix. But if I turn that up now. Welcome to the positive change. And talk box as well is quite a good one. Let's try that. So I'm not really sure how you'd quite use those effects, but they are quite uh, nice to, to show to you on there. And you can do other things as well in vocal synth, like distort. So we can distort the dry. Let's have a listen to that. Welcome to Filter. So had that kind of uh, tannoy effect. Welcome to the positive change guru podcast. And it really does look like the uh, the computer is giving up the ghost on me today. So I'm going to uh, transition over uh, here to the uh, questions and answers section uh, and see if there's any more of your wonderful uh, questions uh, going on in the live chat today. Uh, Mr. Mega Radio UK says it could be uh, that the comments are going crazy today. Uh, yes, absolutely. It could well be that the comments are going crazy, uh, although it shouldn't be bogging down my uh, CPU too much. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
what else have we got? Uh, can I actually pan one stereo track to the left and uh, one to the right uh, in each track? Can I pan one stereo track to the left and right in one track? Oh, um, well, yeah, you can do that. Absolutely, Pete. If you go over to... Um, here, for instance, instead of using the pan knob over here, what I can do is I can draw on an automation here. So I can say pan all the way left, and then pan all the way right, and then pan all the way back to the center again. Uh, so let's drag that in. Oh, really funny computer today. There we go. Right. Let's bring that in and try and play it back. Play. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's not going to play very well, but that will pan uh, left and right if you use those automation envelopes. So that might may well be handy for you. Uh, thank you, Michael, so much for subscribing to the channel. Really appreciate that. Uh, what else have we got in here? Yeah, absolutely. Rovigo55 has nailed it with a comment that CPU speed is indeed never, ever enough uh, to keep up with things. Uh, and, uh, oh, Joe would like to know, how am I sending it to render or pre-render? Uh, so over in the multi-track of Adobe Audition, if you've got like really a ton of stuff going on, if you go over to the mixing view here, um, you see these lightning bolts all here. I wonder if I can just pop this out and zoom in for you. I'll undock this panel and uh, move it down a bit and just try and zoom right in. So you see here, there are lightning bolts. Uh, when I enable the lightning bolt, you see, now without it enabled, everything is green. That's normal in Adobe Audition. And when I do that, uh, and actually if I hover over this icon, you'll see it says pre-render track. It's now frozen, all of that. But again, uh, there's there's a little bit of a problem uh, keeping up with things or so it seems today inside Adobe Audition. But usually, yeah, pre-render will save your, your CPU or whatever is uh, bogging you down. Um, so what else have we got? got um what else what else what else lots of people chatting away there is a contest going on in just a few minutes i'm going to be uh making the draw and uh it'll be absolutely fantastic because someone is going to win a prize on this uh, friday show um rovigo 55 says it was inherited from cool edit pro which is indeed correct. Uh, GK would like to know my computer specifications. What are my computer specifications? It's actually quite good. It's uh, Intel i5 CPU, I think, so pretty good. It's a Mac, uh, it's an iMac, I think it's late 2015, 27-inch uh, uh, 5K Retina, so it's really good, 32 gigs of RAM, um, pretty meaty CPU, so yeah, it's just uh, something is definitely bogging down the stream today, uh, that is for absolute certain, but there you go. If you want to call me in the last uh, five minutes of the show, feel free to. I would love to have someone to chat to. So uh, if you've not called in before and you fancy picking up the phone uh, right now, you can do so. The number is... 415-800-1055. Oh, I'd love to have a bit of banter uh, towards the end of the show. So that's plus one if you're outside the United States. Plus one, 415 800 55. Uh, and let me know what you're getting up to this weekend. Yeah, Rovigo55 is saying you need an i7 uh, processor now. Absolutely. Thanks, Joe. Really kind of you to say great show. Um, Kelvin Guy Reviews. Thank you, Mike, for your work. I'm going to use Audition to edit the sermons for church. That is fantastic. Can I know your recording gear you use uh, to take your voices? Uh, if you go to the link, God Emma Records, that Joe has just posted uh, to mrc.fm slash community, that will take you to an absolutely wonderful place where everybody hangs out when this show ends and talks. Uh, here you can see there's a subcategory called Show Ideas, and we've had a few suggestions already. One of the most popular is for me to do a live show on OBS Studio, how I'm configuring that to do all of my uh, live streaming. So live show on OBS Studio, uh, definitely going to be in the works. But yeah, if you head over, you can see there's a load of different categories, uh, talk about audio production, plugins, effects, uh, audio software, Audition, Audacity, Pro Tools, Logic Pro, uh, place to share your projects and your show rules, your demo tapes, all of that kind of stuff. Uh, you can grab some free stuff. There has been some free stuff available before. Uh, 
uh, as well. Um, and there you go. Uh, Abby's wondering if it's my CPU being in a 2013 computer. It's uh, well, it's it is a 2015 computer, so the spec is pretty good. Um, but yeah, I just think it's been one of those days. I must have. Uh, bogged in a load of effects and it's kind of really held down the CPU but there you go uh, and Joe has also rightly uh, commented that you can go to mrc.fm slash audio producer to get all of the gear I use here in the studio MRC live you're on the air who's this speak to me hello hello, hello. hi who's that hello Hi, Mike. It's Kevin. How are you? Kevin, I'm great. Hi. How are you doing? I'm going very out to air right now. You're on the air right now. Yes. Someone else is calling. I wonder whether I can bring them in. Uh, hello. You're also on the air. Who's this? I'm also on the air. Is someone else calling as well? Yeah, yeah. There's two. Is that David? It could be. <laughs> hey, nice. G'day, David. How you doing? <laughs> pretty good. Pretty good. Excellent. There yeah. is someone else on the line because, as well. Because, the, <laughs> sorry, go ahead. There's also someone else speaking at the same time as well, somewhere as well. I think, I believe. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, what have you got for us, David? You've done a great job in the community, by the way, today in the live chat. Thank you. Um, yes, I, I had I had to grab you because um, because there's so much chatter going on. Loads. Um, you've missed a couple of things that I posted to you. I posted to you. Yes, go for it. Um, that could have helped you out. Um, one was the, um, you could um, nudge the clips using some keys if, you're, um, if your mouse is a bit too picky. I like that. I like that. Um, use, the, um, use the comma and the full stop to um, nudge left and right. Comma and full stop. You grab the clips. Grab the clips mm. and then comma and full stop. Oh, you select, select the clip and then um, tap it left or right and you can nudge it along. Um, hello, Mike. Are you here? Trying that. Yes. Hello. Who's who's that as well? Calling. <laughs> uh, this, this, is, this is Kevin from Cleveland, Ohio. I'm sorry. I, I was Kevin I was in Cleveland. It's wonderful to have you on the line. We have a uh, we have two people on the line right now. This is amazing. I will have to have a play with that to... nudge, David. That sounds really interesting. Okay. How's it going today, Mike? And also a quick question too. Yes. Go for it. Do you do you have? Are you having? Do you put that? Have you got the same effects on each of those um, voice channels? I Correct? have, yes. So it might be best to bust them. I think I did catch your comment on that. Yes, yes. That, yes. That's definitely why your computer's dying on you. <laughs> You've solved all my problems. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Yes, I was. Uh, I was that's putting multiple job. effects on multiple channels, and uh, yeah, I think my CPU <laughs> had a bit. <laughs> Thank you, David. Thank you so much for that. That's something that I would do. That's a, another time saver from Mr. Yes. Shortcuts. Definitely it is. That's what I will do next time. <laughs> yes. Good boy. Cheers. <laughs> okay. All the best. All the best. See you on Monday. And we've got uh, Kevin there as well. Kevin, did you want to say something while you're on? Just quickly before we go. Yeah, so I just wanted to, I just wanted to say how, how's it going tonight, Mike? And I like your show. It's, it's very good. I really appreciate that. It's going really well. And we're just getting to the stage where I'm going to need to wrap up. So I really appreciate your call. Hey, I was wondering if possible on, on Monday, can you do a live tutorial on the noise and voice room over, the noise <laughs> slash voice room over and restoration? I think yes. that will be an interesting topic for everybody there. Definitely. You cover. Definitely. That is yeah. a topic that I've covered recently. Um, so if you go back through the archives, there is a, a recent uh, coverage on noise remover, but I'll definitely do it again for you. That's a, a great idea. Yeah, I just think that'd be interesting. Thank you. Well, thanks for calling. Yeah. Take it easy. All the best. Yeah. And again, I like your shows, Mike. They're Thank you so good. much. Thank yeah. you. Really appreciate that. Yeah. See you later. All right, Bye. Talk to you later. Bye.
<laughs> wow, okay, we are running over time, so i got to get out of here. But first of all, I've got to give away uh, a Sung Decades acapella package uh, to one lucky viewer. Now, I've not tried this giveaway before, so I'm just going to click roll it and see. Maybe Nightbot will announce the winner, or maybe it will just show to me. But I can see a lot of you have been entered into this draw. So now, click roll it, find out who the winner is, and we're going to have a look here now. Uh, come on then, who's it going to be? So we're going to just, uh, yeah, mark everyone who's eligible. Oh, okay, I see. We've got to tick everyone off. Okay, so I'm ticking everyone who has entered. There have been, uh, gosh, nearly 50 entries uh, to win this uh, Sung Jingle package. So let's just tick everyone to make sure everyone gets a fair chance from Nightbot. And once I've ticked all of those entries, I am going to click roll it and hopefully Nightbot will announce a winner for us. So let's see. Da, 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 da. Make sure everyone gets ticked. Here we go. Nearly done. And now I am going to roll it. And uh, we have got Salman Raja. Salman Raja has won the giveaway, according to Nightbot. There you go. And you can see, yes, Nightbot has announced that in the chat. So Salman Raja, thank you so much for uh, entering this contest. And uh, if you get in touch with me after the show, let me know all your details. Uh, best thing is to email us uh, via the website at musicradiocreative.com. You can pick a decade from our Sun Gears jingle a cappella package and have it for yourself. Have a fantastic weekend. I really appreciate you being here. Sorry for a few technical hitches and glitches and me bogging my CPU down. I promise that I will go and have a good sleep over the weekend and, uh, and come back full throttle for Monday's show. Have a great weekend wherever you are and I'll catch you at community.musicradiocreative.com. Dot com.